Hello everyone and welcome back to Dinkum where I have woken up in the rain um, and there's a, I was about to say a dinosaur, <laughs> not a dinosaur, close though, there's a crocodile, oops, no, I didn't mean to do that, just resting my eyes, I wanted to pick it up, oops, how do I, there we go, let's get my sleeping bag back, um, and let's just go inside for a second. Uh, here is little chickadee. <laughs> She's still being um, babysat by Fletch. And I got some milestones last night. Have I gotten this one? Yeah, I've gotten that one. Um, bug catcher. Catching bugs is a great activity. Here's a milestone for catching some of those creepy crawlies. Yay! And you know what? I should probably spend some of my um, license points that I have while I'm here with Fletch. Um... Actually, we'll see if she needs anything. Hey, would it be too much trouble for you to catch a blue moon butterfly? I can definitely catch one of those. They are everywhere. I might even have one already. Do I have one already? Uh, I do not. But I can easily get one of those. Um, and I also want to talk about licenses. Um, I want to apply for a license. Um... Vehicle license. This will would okay. That's actually pretty expensive though. Hmm. Tool belt license. Landscaping. Craft new fencing options. Hmm. Allows me to raise vombats. Notice some buried items using sight low something. Hmm. Um. Simple bridges, landscaping. Because I was thinking water vehicles could be interesting, but I think like if I level this up, I think I could get maybe land vehicles after that, which is what I'm more interested in. Hmm. Um, let's get... I think landscaping, because then I can get more fencing options. Okay, oops. Ooh, yeah, ooh, I got a lot of different fencing options. Okay, oh, a new license available, sign writing license. And, oh, and waterscaping license unlocks the recipes for waterbeds used to create waterfalls. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes, I'm getting that now. There goes my license points. Waterscaping license and a waterbed. Create decorative waterfalls. Oh my gosh, I'm so creating a waterfall like by my house. Um, is there anything else that's new that I've unlocked? Um, okay. Waterscaping is now the max level. Alright, hang in there, chickadee. I'm working on it. Um, last time I was smelting a lot of... What was I smelting? The tin ore and the copper ore. Um, but turns out that it takes five ore to make one ingot. Or one brick or whatever it's called. Um, so I need a lot more. I just, I'm coming in here. Oh, look at all these fences. Palm wood fence. Hardwood fence. I can't get the hardwood yet. What is the... Where's the, um... The gumwood fence? A crude fence. Tin fence. Palm wood gate. Is there a crude gate? I wish I knew what the crude fence looks like. It actually looks kind of cool. But I guess a palm wood fence would look really cool. Oh, here's the gum wood fence. I like the palm wood fence best, I think. What do you need for a crude fence? Just gum log and spin effects resin. Well, we're not going to do that right now. Um, I wanted... Yeah, the bird coop is what I was working on. So I wanted to see what was the... What was this? A grain mill. Ooh, I'm going to need that because I realized last time that Erwin was also selling food for chickadee um, and I didn't buy any, but you can get some with a grain mill. So the bird coop, I need um, more copper and I need another tin sheet. Okay, and I'm going to need a new pickaxe, but I'm going to go back to that spot that I was at before. There's no one visiting today. I'm going to go back to that spot I was at. Ooh. Okay, it's just a turkey that I was at before that had all those minerals and I'm going to get some more. It was copper, wasn't it? Was it copper that I needed? Yeah, more copper. Uh, let's buy... Oh, do I have enough? Okay, yes, I do have enough for a basic pickaxe. 
Yes, I know what it is. I'll take it, thank you. And you know what? Do you need anything while I'm here? Uh, John, come back here. Do you need any... Got a job for me. Hey, would it be too much trouble for you to catch a blue spot flathead? I'm not gonna fish today. No, can't, sorry. If you were after an insect, I'd say sure, but you're not, so. Alright, and so let's keep an eye- Oh! Oh, it's a- it's a toad! I think- Oh dear, that's a crocodile! Um, that's the other thing I was thinking. I should maybe work on crafting some weapons. Oh, is this a blue moon butterfly? I think this might be. Get here. Get over here. There we go. Yep, let's go give that to Fletch before the day is done. Because I might forget it. Oh. Oh, it's a toad skin. Ah, uh, I don't think I need that right now. <laughs> Having this torch as a little light source is really nice. Here you go, Fletch. I have... Um, that butterfly you wanted. Here you go. Oh, you found a blue moon butterfly? I did indeed. Thank you very much, Misty. I'll tell you what, you're always helping me out. Here's a reward, please take it. What'd we get? Ooh, a f wooden flower bed. Decorative wooden flower bed. Oh, that'll be interesting. Oh, there's just so many things to do. Okay, so where is that spot on my map that had all of the... Oh, it's down here. Oh, it's a little waddle away. Uh, we'll be okay. Let's head that direction. Sort of diagonal direction. Hi, Jackaroo. I realise that these are called Jackaroos because it's like a play on um, a jackalope, I think they're called. Which is like a mythical cross between a deer and a rabbit. And so these are Jackaroos because they're a cross between a kangaroo and, and a deer. I was about to say a kangaroo and a rabbit. That's not correct. Um, let's just, we're just going to run over there. Oh, having a land vehicle would be really nice right now so that I could because I've seen in like the loading screen that there's a motorbike um next to John's goods shop and that would be oh dear this is why we need weapons although I'd rather not hurt the crocodiles but they may not give me a choice ha ah, here we go this is it isn't it yeah well I mean it's close to the area Main thing is, is that it has the materials I need. Come on, oh, it takes so much. And I noticed last time that I accidentally left some of my um, minerals behind after I'd mined them, so I'm going to be very careful to collect everything this time. I think that's quartz there. Let's get tin and copper. Get it all. Get it all. So yeah, I'm gonna need another 10, it seems, um, of the ore in order to get two more ingots. Or bars, that's what they're called. Oh, and I'm running low on energy. Do I have any food? I have some apples and some of these. Uh, I guess we'll put that there. Oh, I'm running low on space. I don't want to eat all my apples because I want to plant one. Ooh, got a new achievement. What did I get? Oops. Super taster. Fruit, meat, fungus, it doesn't matter. Food will give you energy to keep doing your tasks all day long. Here's milestone for eating things. <laughs> I wish I got rewarded for eating things in real life. That'd be nice. Oops, there we go. And this pickaxe is going to run out soon. Um, I, well, I guess we'll... No, I can't grab the rock. Um, let's just get all the materials I can while I'm here. Is there any more over here? Oh, here's some more tin. And I've actually been having second guesses about where I want to have my house. Because it's really far away from the town. And I thought I wanted it far away from the town. But maybe I don't want it that far away. I might want to put it somewhere else. Um, oh, here we go. Here's the spot. Look, this is so much stuff. That said, it may not feel so far away once I have... Ooh. Ooh, ooh, that looks interesting. What is that? Uh, what is that? 
Ah. Uh, no. Grab it. Grab it. Oh, it's just another lager day. I don't want it. No. Let's eat one more apple and then we can switch over to these quandongs. Okay, I'm full now. Oh, I'm still low on energy. Man, mining takes so much. How many ore do I have? Nine. Oh, I just need one more copper ore. Come on. Oh, there goes my pickaxe. Okay, I've got my new one. Come on, before I run out of energy. Oh, yes, there we go. I'm so tired. And I can't eat anymore. Will, like, will it take my hunger down as I... Because I just ate. Okay, I got a little bit more energy. I'm too full now. But at least now I can run. And I have just enough ore. Am I heading in the right direction? Yes, I am. Okay. Can I get some wattle? Do I have wattle in my inventory? I don't. Oh, I should have sold stuff to John before I left. That's okay. Oh, you know, I wanted to metal detect as well while I was out here. Nothing? Okay, let's just keep going. Harm. Hopefully this re weather lets up soon because it's very wet and miserable. Okay, we're nearly there. Hi, little cockatoo. Oh. <laughs> I'm stuck on a termite mound. All right. Let's go sell something. Actually, no, I'll put some ore in the smelter furnace. That's what it's called. In the furnace first, and then I'll go sell some stuff to John. Okay. And insert. There we go. That will create one bar. Man, it's so expensive. Alright. John should still be there. Yeah, it's only 1 p.m. Hi, John. I need to sell some things. All right, I want to sell. We'll just sell the old gears. Um, and I need that. The bright wire will sell. I think I could use that for towels, but I'm not working on that sort of thing right now. And I can always get more. Um, I think I need the old spring though. Um, I can always get more by metal detecting, like I was before. Okay, let's sell these. Let's see. All up, I can offer you 12,000. Jeez. Sounds good. Man, the metal detecting is a great way to make money. Ooh, what's this? This is different. What's this blue thing? Home customization kit? How much is that? 25,000. Wow. I don't even have a home to customize. I should probably work on that. Wait, what was that thing? What's this? A machine manual? 15,000. Okay, so 12,000 dinks isn't seeming that um, plentiful anymore. All right, come on. Is my ore finished? Yeah. And now insert some more. Got another milestone. Making bars. Smelting. Oh, you've been smelting, all right. Here's a milestone for smelting ore into bars. Thank you. And slowly I'm working towards making a bird coop for chickadee, but I'm also going to need a fencing. So what do I need for fencing? I guess it depends what fence I'm making. What does a gum wood? Just needs nails and gum wood plank. I like the palm wood though. Palm wood planks and nails. Oh, well that's easy. Um, I can craft some more nails right now. Awesome. And I also, yeah, I needed those for um her house as well. All right, is this done nearly? Oh, and you know what? I need some gumwood planks. So let's get my, do I not have, oh, here we go. Here's my gumwood. Oh, here we go. Let's get this. And I guess I may as well smelt my tin ore, whoops. My tin ore while I'm here as well. And then I can 
turn these logs into planks. This is nice and fast, at least. At least. <laughs> Just turn them all into planks, I think. Because I'm going to need the planks for lots of different things. Awesome. Alright, and how much longer will that all be? I think I might have every- oh, I just need a tin sheet. Which I don't have the recipe for, so I'm gonna need to metal detect for that. So maybe something around here? I seem to have the best luck out in the desert. Maybe something over here? Yeah, because I don't have- a recipe for a metal sheet yet but I was able to find one while metal detecting I'm pretty sure come on or yes there we go yeah, let's pick this oops no 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 I didn't mean to pick that up um good place that down again um oh there's a bunch of meat I don't want that is there some fruit around here I can eat like some limes is there any bush lime around I know there's the cactus, but I can't really eat those because it actually hurts me when I try to eat them. Hmm. Um. So I'm just looking at my energy. It's kind of low. And I can't eat the toad. Uh, you know, I'm just going to start metal detect- Oh. Let's just start uh, metal detecting- Come on. Come on. Oh! I think it's in this spot right there. Um, oh, I need my shovel. Okay. Is it this spot? No, I think it was this spot. Oh, okay. Um, oh, I need my pickaxe again. Okay, and I got milestone. Oh, ooh, archaeologist. There is stuff everywhere underground. Here's a milestone for digging up treasure. Yay! And what's the other one? Soil mover. Pick up some dirt, put it there. Here's a milestone for moving soil. Thank you. Okay, let's... Oh, no, this one. Come on. Oh, I got a bright wire. Um, oh, get tin sheet! Yes, perfect! First time around, that's exactly what I needed. Man, I really love my metal detector so much. And, you know, maybe I should grab this meat. I'm gonna grab this meat. I don't know what it's from. It could be from a dingo. It could be from a jackaroo. I don't know. Uh, but we're gonna take it and I can cook it up later at my house. Oh, there's no bush limes here. Okay, um, have I got everything? I have everything I need to make the bird coop now, yes! Let's come in here. And I know, chickadee, I know I'm working as fast as I can. Let's craft a bird coop! Yay! Okay, and now I need fencing. So, I want the palm wood fence, I think. Palm wood plank and nails, it makes eight. Okay, let's craft it. I think we're going to need more than eight, though, so let's go get some more palm wood. Where did I get the palm wood from? Wait, don't I have some palm wood seeds? Oh, but they won't grow fast enough. Um, hmm, I have one palm wood plank. Oh, wait, oh, yeah, and one palm wood log. I think I saw some palm wood stumps over here. Are these palm wood stumps? Yeah! Let's get rid of these stumps. Okay, and where are some actual palm trees? Oh, I know where the palm trees are. They're in the like tropical areas, right? And there's one just over here. Oh, but that's also where cassowaries are. Okay, I'm gonna need to be very careful as I do this. Oh good, and some bush limes. I would take those gladly. Let's put my kwandong away. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. It sounds funny. It's a funny word. Let's get my more. Oh, come on. Bush limes. Let's eat some of this. Okay, I can see the palm trees. 
Are there any cassowaries nearby, though? Because I do not want to deal with those. Oh, okay, that's just a turkey. Okay, I think, I think we're okay. Yeah, we're okay. Let's get the stumps first. Oh, that was easy. We'll get one of these. Come on. There we go. Oh, and we got a seed and a bunch of palm wood. And I think if we dig, oops. Oh, I got a fern seed. Oh, I didn't know that was a thing. But I think if I dig and I can, oops, um, put the bug net away. If I put, um, how do I, that there, and then I, um, yeah, there we go. I can make a little sapling. So we'll just replace um, what we just took. Eight, that should be enough, right? Let's get some more of these little stumps. Because they're not going to grow into trees. Any more little stumps? Um, oh, and we'll check this milestone. Timber, sometimes trees get in the way and sometimes you just got to borrow their wood for a bit. Here's milestone for cutting down trees. I feel kind of bad for cutting down the trees, but at least I'm replanting. Okay, now I can go back and I can create a little home for Chickadee. This is the right way, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I can see the tent over there. All right. Here we go. We're going to create a little home for Chickadee next to my home. I may move Chickadee's home at a later point because I think I might want to move... Like, because I have a tent down there, but I might want to move my, like, build my house somewhere else. Okay, um, palm wood fence. Oh, I need more nails. Let's craft some more of those. And get the palm wood fence. Oh, wait. And also, what do I need for the palm wood gate? Okay, two planks. All right, um, I actually need to turn my wood into planks. I was just planning to use logs, apparently. Okay. Here we go. Just gonna turn all of this into planks. And I got another milestone, what for, like, cutting wood? What's a milestone for? So good. <laughs> you like wood, right? But what about square wood? Here's a milestone for cutting wood into planks. <laughs> so many milestones. Okay. Let's head back. And now I can craft another eight fences that gives me 16 i think that should be enough for just a small little um thing for chickadee i kind of wish the gate looked different but let's craft this gate and can i make an, so, so a few more fences uh, i just need some more nails i'll craft some more nails and one more lot of these fences all right, let's go and I can take Chickadee with me. All right, come on Chickadee. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's raining Chickadee. Hopefully the cardboard box won't get too soggy. I know Chickadee, I know I'm going as fast as I can. I'm gonna bring you over to my house, well over to my tent and that's where I will set up your little enclosure, which I may move at a later date. Um, But I just want her over near my house for now. Oh dear. Oh dear, I need to be careful. I need to really make sure that she's fenced in so that the dingoes can't get her. Um, hmm, where do we want to... I guess we'll put her behind my house. I know, Chickadee, I know. I think this is a good spot. Um, okay, so we're just going to drop the box here. Oh, and now we've got the fences and the gates. Okay, so let's get that and let's get the bird coop. All right, so I think this area, actually, where's the, my ax to? So we're gonna get rid of this. 
Um, okay, now let's set up some fencing. Like, here? Okay, that's easy. And we'll have our gate here. I don't think it needs to be too big just yet for Chickadee. We'll make it a little bit bigger than that though. Oops. Um, I want to get rid of this one. Okay. And that. And oh dear, we need to chop down this tree. Sorry, tree. I'm just building a home for Chickadee. All right. Let's keep building. And I have to get rid of this rock. Poor Chickadee's just out in the rain right now. Hang in there, Chickadee. I'm working as fast as I can. Let's get rid of this stump. Okay. And let's place some more fences. I think this will be a good size. Will I oh my gosh, will I have enough? Please tell me I'll have enough. Oh yeah, I have plenty. There we go. I think this will be okay for a little starter. Oh, some gum nuts. Okay, and I want to make sure nothing can get in. So can things get in if they... Oh, I can jump over. But can dingoes jump over? I don't think they can jump over. I'm kind of worried though. So I'm just going to move some dirt. Oops. Just want to move this dirt away. So that they can't jump over this area and get chickadee. Because I'm worried about dingoes getting my poor little chickadee. Ooh, what's that? Something sparkling that I can pick up. What is this? Ooh, grass seeds! And I need to eat. Okay. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Oh, just this one. There we go. We can... Put that here. Oh my gosh, it's getting so late. Um, eat some, uh, eat some bush limes. Okay, let's grab these grass seeds. All right, I think this will be safe. Oh, there's also this rock here that they could jump over and get chickadee. I just don't want anything to kill chickadee. I'm very concerned about things killing chickadee. I know chickadee. Hang in there. I'm working as fast as I can. Okay, and I guess we'll just get rid of this rock too. Okay, and get rid of this dirt. And now I think this should be safe. Oh, we should also put some torches down. I'm going as fast as I can, Chickadee. The cardboard box is probably soaked by now. Can I put torches on top of? No, I can't. Okay, um, I'll just put torches around then. Around this area for chickadee. So it's nice and lit up. Okay, and now let's put the bird coop down. Um, oops, no, I didn't. Oh, well, I guess that's where it's going now. Can I move it? I can, okay. That wasn't where I wanted to put it. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess it can go there in that corner. And then we have the gate. Here we go! Okay, chickadee! I'm just getting the grass seeds. Let's pick this up. We're ready to release chickadee! Um, actually, you know what? I'm gonna sleep first before I release her. Because I don't want to release her in the rain. <laughs> just gonna drop this here. <laughs> We're just gonna quickly sleep. Call it a day, guess, sleep until tomorrow, and then I will release Chickadee in the morning. It was just, it was raining and late. I want to make sure that she is safe and not in the rain. Oh my gosh, I really hope it's not raining today. Please don't be raining today. Okay. Wild animals can be kept in a pen if you fence them off. That is good to know. Owen's visiting. Oh, good. I'll be able to get food for Chickadee. I was really worried. All right, Chickadee. The time has come. I don't hear any rain. Yay, it's a sunny new day. I know, Chickadee. I know. We're going. We're going. Um, Let's just drop that for a second. 
Open this. This up. And drop that. And then uh, close that. All right, chickadee, are you ready? Are you ready? And release. Ah, chickadee. <laughs> I can pet her. What? Oh my gosh, that is too cute. Hi, little chickadee. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. Oh my gosh, she's so adorable. I will get food for you on the next episode. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here with Chickadee. Is she going to go into her little chicken house? Go into your little chicken house, Chickadee. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up as well as subscribe and hit the notification bell. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a video. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!